request to videotape my green wall here. Now as you can see, it goes into there. So it's just a tiny green wall. But I'll show you kind of like, you know, my ceiling in here in the kitchen and stuff. Um, those are my pinatas. Um, I believe that one came from Dollar General or Walmart. I don't remember. It's been up there for so long. And um, so they really uh, like these big, she called them cauldrons or something like that. I get, I don't know. I call them pitchers. Uh, and they are from Mexico. Um, we used to buy all of our stuff at the flea market from this lady who lived over here, but they would travel to Mexico and bring back a huge truckload of stuff, and then they would sell it over here and make a profit, because from what I understand, over in Mexico, you can buy stuff really, really cheap over there, so, um, the fruit there that came from Mexico, um, that Corona <laughs> piñata, well, we went to a, a Mexican restaurant about 40 miles away over there, close to where my son and daughter-in-law live. And they had them there, and I said, ooh, I really want one of those, you know. So we asked them, and they sold it to us for 10 bucks. And then the next time we went, they had some different ones, and they wouldn't sell them. They said, no, they're not for sale. I said, well, heck. But I'm glad I got that one anyway, because it's kind of different and unusual. So there's my peppers up there in the corner. Um, I think that I bought those off that lady also. This is not from Mexico. It came out of a catalog, but I just fell in love with it. And there's my little llama from uh, Dollar Tree. And then this little couple uh, came from Mexico. And, of course, some of the Dollar Tree stuff there. And then my little girl from Bonnie at Bon Bon's Halls. And then my little doll here. She came from Mexico. The uh, sugar skulls, those came from Michael's. Um, one year, I don't know, we got lucky and they had a bunch of sugar skull stuff over there close to Halloween, so we bought that. And then this is just a bottle of liquor or something, but I bought the little, this little, um, what do you call these? Oh, I can't think this morning. Sarabi. Sarabi! I put that over that bottle there, so. And then this is what I keep all of my receipts in, and it's pretty full, y'all, as you can see. So that, that's from Mexico also. And then the sun, the middle sun, that's from Mexico. The moon is from Mexico. That garlic, I'm thinking we bought it from her too. I, I, I'm not for sure. The guitar, I don't, I don't know where I got it. I don't remember. I don't think we got it from south of the border. Um, I don't know where we bought that thing. Um... I think I bought this at a yard sale or something and I painted it the green on the outside which it kind of it kind of matches the wall a little bit but it's okay and then I painted the corn inside because it's a it's a mold for uh, cornbread but you know I said well you know I don't like washing those things they start rusting and everything so I said this hanging on the wall so I bought this this whoop, whoops this right here from Tractor Supply, right? It had a candle in it. It's like a skillet candle. So after I used it up, I said, I want to hang that on the wall. So I bought this huge, um, let me see if it's, yeah, it's like a, it's like a huge magnet from, um, from south of the border. And I glued him on there. Oh, and this right here, that cactus one, I think, I don't know where I got these. I, I think I bought them at a yard sale, I guess. And then the peppers, I believe, I'm not sure I, if those are from Mexico or from Walmart. I couldn't tell you. And then my little gecko down there. And then, see my little um, outlet cover? I painted it, and then I went to Michael's and bought me some of the Mexican stickers. And I put them on there, guys. And you can do that. It's so simple, so easy. And I painted two different colors, kind of blended them in. So I was being creative there, y'all. So then up here, that is not from Mexico. That was from a catalog, and I can't tell you the name of the catalog. I don't remember. But I liked it, so I bought it. And also those little uh, chicken, the corner little things there. I like those. I bought those from a catalog also. And then coming over here... 
I painted, that's like the doorbell thing up there, so I painted it, put the little pots on it, and um, I think I bought that little steer head from her also. And then the metal pieces here, I bought those out of the uh, I think it was collections where it's, um, you pay, it, they're like, things are like $15 and below, I believe, so anyway. And then, of course, my... Oh, and then that cactus there. I, I just recently bought that cactus. <laughs> Probably from Walmart. And of course, my little baker's rack. And then I got my little my little donut sitting there because um, I like to do those whenever I'm filming. Put them on there. And then I put them over there on my little cake stand I made. So, until I find some more. I got my little cow bank there. It's getting full of change. I've been saving it up. Then I can go shopping. I go shopping anyway, y'all. I go shopping a little bit too much. Um, and then there's my little thing that I made the very first time I filmed. I was showing y'all what I did there because I bought all of that, the little fairy garden stuff over at Michael's. They have some cute stuff, and if you can get it for 40% off, man, you're doing good. And then, of course, down here... So, my little fairy house and stuff. That is from Hobby Lobby. And I bought the little chicken salt and pepper shakers from Tractor Supply. Um, they were like 40% off. And then the three little, um, like the sheep and the pig and the cow. I think I showed those to you on, on one haul. Those are from Dollar General. I tell you what, Dollar General has some cute stuff, you guys. And then my little... Um, I don't know what you, what you call that. It's just a jug, and I filled it with some pink hearts from my Dollar Tree. So, yeah, so this is basically, this is all of my green mall, and I'll show you a little bit over here, too. Uh, this is my, my china cabinet here, and it's full of, I don't know if we can see it or not here, but it's full of sugar skull stuff. And those sugar skulls I got from Michaels. And yeah, most of those. And then some of them was gifts. Uh, so yeah. And then my dolls here. They, these are from Mexico. They were painted and made in Mexico. And I know that there's a glare here. Let me open this up. Okay, this be better. So. They get dusty even in there. So I just love these dolls. Um, some some of them I have tried to sell and everything, but people don't really. I mean, they only cost, they, they were about $20 a piece, which I think is a really good deal. And then here's another one down here. And then my cow collection. I forget what you call these cows. I don't remember. But anyway. Hey, get on over there. But yeah. And then I have like a little kind of like a Chihuahua collection and poodles. Got a couple of poodles there. And then some more stuff. I, I tell you what, this thing is packed full. I probably should clear it out a little bit. But um, yeah. I bought whoops. I'm clicking something and I shouldn't be clicking. Um, you know, these are from South of the Border, those Chihuahuas. See, I really don't need any of this stuff. And then this girl, of course, she's from Mexico. But see the cat right there? I got that at Goodwill. Isn't it cute? <laughs> okay. So, I will try to videotape some more stuff here. Um, I've got, I, I don't know, like in my kitchen here, see the ceiling and stuff? Yeah, like I said, it looks like a Mexican restaurant. So, I'll do some more filming pretty soon. And i uh, show you the rest of my rooms because I have a, I have like a pink room and I have an Indian room or I call it Smoky Mountain room in there. I'll show y'all that later. So, and then I have like a huge great room in there. So I'll show that to y'all too. So see, everything's kind of a mess right now. <laughs> okay, guys, thanks for watching. See y'all next time. Bye.